It's a little bit like science fiction, only without the fiction part. We call it science faction. It really makes people think about the role of technology in their everyday life. Meet Danish psychologist Henrik Schaffe and his mechanical counterpart, Geminoid DK. Schaffe is leading a research team at Auburg University and a study designed to get a better grasp of how we interact with robots. With the help of his robo-twin, Schaffe aims to test how much automation society is willing to take. Imagine, for instance, you have someone like this sitting at a kindergarten telling stories. It doesn't have to be my face, it could be another face. And then the robot will tell your stories over and over and over and over again. Now people usually object to this idea. And then I ask them, are you happy with a TV or a DVD set doing the same thing? And they typically say, oh yeah. So I'm interested in what, what makes up the difference here. The difference may go beyond the obvious benefits like convenience and efficiency. This robot, a baby seal, has been shown to have positive therapeutic effects on the emotional lives of seniors in Japan. A robot summit of sorts took place with the three existing Geminoids, two from Japan and, of course, DK. They all brought their human counterparts. And take a good look at DK, because he will be interacting with an unsuspecting Danish public to see what kind of reactions he elicits. An experiment in which he fires an employee is even on the table. As for now, DK will just be confusing Shafa's colleagues in the hallways. Nick Dietz, CBSNews.com.